Hello. Hello. Well, this week we're going to have an update video about the progress of our wooden deck. Yeah, so let's, let's get, get started. started. Well, in theory, the second half of our wooden deck is supposed to be exactly the same as the first half, right? And quicker to install it, yeah, as we course. already knew what to do. Yeah, but in reality, after we showed you half of the wooden deck, so many people comment on the comment section below, and we realized that we've done some mistakes. Yeah, first of them... Yeah, actually this video is going to be about mostly about the mistakes <laughs> we have done on the first episode, and some of the progress of this second half. So first mistake? Uh, we used glue with uh, wood power for the first part. Yeah, Pe people said that glue, it's, uh, the base for the glue is water, and when it rains, mixed with water and would just like not work. And they were right. And they were right. <laughs> so fixing the information we gave you guys two weeks ago, no. Glue, white glue for the outside doesn't work. The rain just, just, for the inside just forget part. it. So what we decide to do is to take all the you know the filler with glue and powder that we did take all off and uh, switch to wooden filler. wooden filler that's made for wood so I hope this works I mean we thought it was gonna work and it did for a while but then we gave we found a second problem the kind of screws we use we use uh, it's, it's B, like bichromate zade or zade, something like this and the reason why we use that is because we decided we're going to cover, you know, the hole so water wouldn't go through. But we forgot that in between the joists and the decking, there's always a small space and with time water goes inside. And talking to a lot of people about that, they say that these kind of screws won't last for like more than a year. And then we were like, that's a big problem because, you we're know, screwed. yeah, we're screwed <laughs> because after a year, if the screw decide to break in half, how do we take the rest off? So that would become an even bigger problem. Yeah. So we decided that as we need to take all the glue off, we, it's already halfway done. So we decide to buy new screws and ex exchange the screws to use stainless, stainless steel. steel. Yeah, some people said that stainless steel is too expensive and we agree it's too expensive, but we don't have much options where we buy screws there, either stainless steel or this one or zinc and, or something. And if you need to exchange in a year or two... Yeah, so if we need to change every year, it's yeah. in the end, the stainless steel is going to be the, a good price. Yeah. So we decide to change all the screws. So what we're going to do, you're going to exchange slowly, you know, like we're not necessarily going to do all this week, otherwise we won't finish the wooden deck. So we are going to do the new ones with the new screws and then we're going to start like changing. I mean, we started changing already uh, some there of them. The ones that we did yesterday that's still wet, so yeah. we are taking it, it off. Yeah, so basically from now on we're going to have stainless steel screw and flush with the decking. The old ones that we took off, we are going to uh, fill up the gap with the filler and, and then the screw powder. so we don't have like uh, filler and powder. Yeah, so filler and wood powder so we don't have any you know, hole left and yeah. that comes to the second problem what's the second problem the gap between the lumber yeah the thing is the gap we left in between the deckings there's enough space for the water to go through but i think if if we had left a little bit more space maybe the water would go through quicker you know wouldn't wouldn't stay there for too long and maybe the decking would last for longer so we are doing an experiment, yeah. as usual. <laughs> so half of the house is going to be with the smaller gap, and the second half is going to be with like twice as much gap. And with that... We are going to see in future how long yeah, they Yeah, so it's like a uh, real-life experiment. Yeah. In five <laughs> years, you're going to know how is this part and how is that part, and we're going to let you guys know yeah. which one works better. Of course, the bigger gap must work better, but how much better, that's what we don't know. Because, I mean, like, if it's from five years to six years, I'm not yeah. sure if it's in worth it because it looks a lot better with the small gap. But if it's from five years to 10 years, from 10 years to 20 years, and then, you know, 
So I, I think we can show the video clip. Yeah. So I for now for today that's it. We're basically talking about all the mistakes we've done, and we are going to show you guys now some of the progress we did this week. We didn't do much progress because it's just raining, raining, and raining. Or and when it's not or raining, the sun is really hot. Yeah, or the sun is really, really hot, and we cannot stay like more than two hours, and we need to take a break, and two hours take a break, and it's just too hot. But it's looking good. <laughs> I mean, we are really excited about it. Yeah. It's, it's, I mean, we can walk around already on the top. It's just like seems like much bigger the space now than before because of the 30 centimeters hang outside. So video, video clip. clip. No. Ah. these downstairs because if we live here it's gonna be on the sun and it's not you know locked on place so it's gonna bend all over so we're gonna take down this and then we're gonna cut the rest paint. paint the rest and maybe in two three days we're gonna come back and screw everything on place it's gonna take a while but we get there let's do it Instead of using this, that's not accurate, we are using this to have the, uh, the same gap between them. Yeah, there was someone that commented on a video that said that we could have like a, you know, a template or something. And that's what you're gonna use. Part of the shipping container. <laughs>
the new screws the deck lasts forever <laughs> not forever but longer than before forever <laughs> yeah, that would be cool but no. no but i mean at least for longer uh okay. next week we are planning to finish the wooden deck we are planning to do the the finishings that we are planning we yeah, need to buy the wood how I, I i don't remember the name but that's the name of the two things we still need to do that's yeah. the outside of the joists yeah. and the underneath of the joists these both both these names and the thing is we cannot guarantee the weather is going to be good and we don't want to have another five episodes about the wooden yeah. deck i know you guys must be tired of watching the wooden deck so we want to have only one more episode and f be done, 100% done with the wooden deck. So if by next week we don't finish the wooden deck, what we are going to do is we are going to have a Q&A. I think it's about time, like a lot of people are asking so many questions about how we produce the videos and about uh, how we are going to do this in the house, a how we are going to do that, uh, why we did this, why we did that, and all, all sorts of questions about the building, about why we chose a shipping, a shipping container, about why we do videos, about why this format of videos and all, all, any, anything about us, about whatever you want to know. So, you can send us some questions that we are glad to answer. Yeah, so leave us a comment down below with what you want to know, anything. Just be smart, don't, don't ask <laughs> weird things. But I mean, mostly anything. And then, if we finish the deck by next week, we're going to have an episode about the decking and then the Q&A is going to be on the following week. If we didn't, if we don't finish, then next week's gonna be the Q and A. So basically, you have like three days to send us questions. If you can send through here, or you can send through Instagram, or, or through Facebook. email, or, or Facebook, or whatever. Yep. So that's it. So we see you guys next week with some answers or with a finished wooden deck. Yeah. So see you guys next, next. week. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave us a thumbs up.